everyone, it's Melody. I'm here with another Inside the Dressing Room. We're at Kohl's today. Um, I am just looking at some tops. Uh, my outfit for the day includes an Old Navy t-shirt, a pair of American Eagle sky-high jeggings, my Birkenstocks. Look at this big old Kohl's dressing room. It's huge. I could like lay down in here. Um, I had my Louis Vuitton Bloomsbury and um, I also put my cell phone up in this little area right there. Is that what it's for? I don't know, but I thought I would put it up there. Um, like I said, or did I say? Um, I am only trying on tops today. I cleared out a bunch of tops during a purge recently, and um, I just decided I needed some nice fitted t-shirts. Um, so here is one. It's a nice v-neck in this wine uh, maroonish color. I really liked it. The sh sleeves felt a little short, but I'm just trying to get comfortable uh, wearing more fitted tops. So this one I actually liked um, a lot. Doesn't look too bad. I'm just trying to get used to fitted tops, you guys. Uh, the nice thing about this too was it had a uh, curved hemline, which is always quite flattering. I feel like it um, was long enough to cover my torso and everything, so I didn't feel uncomfortable in it. Here is a black scoop neck one from the same line, same brand. It's just a uh, scoop neck versus a v-neck. Um, I tried this on in a medium. It fit fine, uh, fit really good. Again, that curved hemline, which is really flattering. Um, in this next clip though, I do try it on in a large and I felt more comfortable in the large. Uh, it still remained pretty fitted. However, I just felt like if I were to wash it and if something were to go awry, <laughs> um, I just felt like this would still hold uh, most of its size and shape. So here is the large same shirt. I think it fits nicer on me. What do you guys think? Do you guys think the medium was better? I don't know. I thought the large was okay. So um, there is that. I'm realizing now that I'm watching these clips that my American Eagle jeggings are definitely too big on me. I think I might have to get rid of those soon. Here's a really fun top though. I know that this tie-up lace-up trend is super huge. I never really liked it for myself, especially because most of them cut down so far deep into the bust. Um, however, this one remained pretty high up. It was a nice v-neck, um, nice scooped hemline again. Um, this was a size large and I ended up trying it on in a medium, I believe, as well. Um, yeah, here we go. It's a size large in this clip and it just felt a little bit loose again on me and again, I'm trying to go for more fitted tops. I have some loose fitting tops um, so I just want to try to get things that are a little bit more flattering and here's the medium now and I do think that uh, the medium did fit better overall for me. The nice thing about this shirt was it's actually a nice thick rib knit material versus just a cotton jersey sort of t-shirt material so it did feel really nice I didn't have to worry about um, uh, you know things showing and being too sheer and whatnot so I really liked that um, now he, this next clip I'm trying on uh, this shirt and you can see what I mean by when it's so loose fitting I just feel like I lose a lot of my shape and I've started to finally realize that now um, after having lost weight it's just it's a hard thing to kind of grasp, you know? Like, I'm always just so used to wearing loose things that you don't realize you can wear tight things, you know? So anyways, the nice thing about this shirt was it had that like lace-up kind of tie-up detail in the back, which is actually kind of cute, but I did not like this shirt because of that kind of flared um, detail like I had described. So here it is again. Um, this is the one thing I did not pick up. I am back home now and I thought I would show you guys a few of the things that I did purchase at Kohl's and I picked up uh, two things from Target as well. I'm gonna go ahead and start with the Target stuff since I didn't film anything in Target. Um, they were having the Morona men's tank tops on sale for $6 which is amazing because I think just like a month ago I bought a couple of tank tops for like full price like $9 or whatever it was. Anyways, I, so I got two more tank tops. I love wearing these to sleep. Um, I'll just like wear one out if I need to go make a quick stop to the grocery store. I love these. Um, so I got two of these Morona men's tank tops. Got one in this striped kind of red teal color and then another one in the striped with the seafoam green. 
see foam green, excuse me, um, and those were $6. So pretty excited about those. And then you guys saw me try on a few things at Kohl's. Um, so I did pick up three of the, um, what are they actually called? The Perfect Scoop shirts. Actually, this one is a scoop. Uh, the black one I got in a large because it fit better. It, more comfortably, I just shouldn't say better. The medium fit fine, but I just felt more comfortable with the large, um, especially if I wash it. I was just like, oh my gosh, if this shrunk even just a little with the medium, I was going to be a little hesitant about it. Um, what is this? Is that a sticker? There's a piece of plastic on this shirt. I will have to look at it again. So this is the perfect V-neck. These are all by the SO brand. Um, in the junior se juniors section. So I got the v-neck in uh, the olive green. I would have got the v-neck in the black too, but they didn't have one. And then I got the v-neck in the dark maroon. These are my usual go-to colors. So I got those three shirts. They were on sale. And then I also had a 20% off coupon. And then I also had a $10 um, like kind of gift card, I guess. Uh, they just mail those bad boys out that you can use on any purchase. So for those shirts, I got them for $5.25 each. Pretty good if you, if I, um, if I say so myself. Um, especially since the quality feels pretty good. Um, and then I got two of those uh, tie up front shirts. So you saw me try one on uh, in the black. I actually really like it. This is a really nice thick material. I mean, it's like a knitted uh, ribbed, yeah, like a rib knitted sort of shirt. So uh, I thought these were really nice. I, I almost picked up three of them, but I just got two because I didn't think I'd wear the blue one. So I got it in black and I got these in a medium um, and I got it in the like maroon wine reddish color as well. Also in a medium. Those with the discount and they were on sale and with the discount and with my $10 off, it they both um, came out to 10.50 each, so not bad. So for five shirts, I spent 39.79. Not bad at all. I'm on a um, no spend June sort of mission, and I haven't spent money on myself for the first week of June. I didn't spend anything on myself, and when I say no spend, I mean obviously I have bills to pay <laughs> and like groceries and things. Those all you know I I have to pay for. So. Um, that's fine, but anything like personal material belongings for myself, I've been trying not to spend. Um, I went seven days without buying anything, and then last night I bought um, a few shirts on OldNavy.com, but now that I have these shirts, now that I bought these, I actually might return those once that order does come in, so we will see. Um, but I'm pretty excited since I really did need some new tops. Um, I just got rid of a bunch, um, and I needed more flattering tops, more fitted shirts. So really excited about these, and especially the uh, kind of the lace-up bit one, since I don't have any shirts like that, and I feel like that's a little different from what I typically wear. Um, but I'm really excited about these comfortable ones here too. So uh, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you guys want to see more from me, check out the links in the description box below. Uh, comment, like, subscribe, all of that fun sort of stuff. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye! Bye.